Every semester, we like to honor our distinguished UH alumni. Representative Greg Takeyama has been a lawmaker for almost a decade. Lydia Tristan has more on this proud UH journalism grad. State Representative Greg Takeyama's colorful shirts are seen as a symbol of his colorful career. During his time at UH, he worked as a journalist for both the student newspaper and the Star Bulletin. Later, he got into TV news and public relations, and now serves as a lawmaker representing Pearl City. Recently, our class got a chance to sit down with him in studio. How has your experience in journalism helped prepare you to be a politician? I think being a journalist teaches you to listen. You know, they often say you have uh, two ears and one mouth for a good reason. You ought to be used uh, in that proportion. And so I've always taught myself to, to listen to other people. And that really is the hallmark of a journalist. To, a good journalist listens to other people, listens to their stories, and lets them tell it. And, and that, to me, is what I practice uh, still as a, as a government official. Takayama is used to being seen across all forms of media. But he says he wasn't always so comfortable being in the public eye. You know, I've always been personally kind of a shy person. And one of the things about journalism is it forces you out of your shyness. It becomes, it, it requires you to, to meet people, to talk to people who you had no idea of, of meeting in the first place. But it that becomes your job, your, your, your profession, and it forces you out of your shell. Takayama grew up in Kalihi Valley and graduated from Farrington High School. One of the things about growing up in Kalihi Valley was, um, you know, running around outside in the neighborhood, you know, we, we yelled and screamed and pigeon all the time, as, as was natural as, as all the kids did. But at minute my brothers and I stepped back into the house, my mom insisted that we speak proper English. And so I, I never regretted it because, as it turned out, every job I've ever had required me to speak proper English. And, and so that was one of my childhood memories. Takayama was one of the first in his family to go to college, spending his first two years in Oregon before transferring to UH Manoa. And so I transferred back to UH because the UH then had a, a much better journalism program than they had in Oregon. So I ended up um, uh, finishing out uh, my last two years here at uh, UH Manoa, working on a student newspaper, where, as it turned out, I met my wife and, and many other friends for life. His opportunities at UH led him to Washington, D.C., where he served as a press secretary for the late Senator Dan Inouye. I've covered the shortcomings of government, the inefficiencies, the corruption at times of, of politicians. And, but working for Senator Inouye showed me the good side. And so I decided that um, when, if I had the opportunity to work in government, I would concentrate on doing good for the community as, as, as much as I could. And so that was, led to my decision to run for um, the State House 10 years ago, and I've never regretted it. You know, I've, I've done my best to serve our community and the state, and in a small way, I, I think I have. One of his highlights as a lawmaker was introducing a bill that became known as Anya's Law. It's named after a little girl who was suffering from a cleft palate condition. I've always prided myself on that being one of my um, proudest accomplishments as a lawmaker because it, it only affects like maybe a dozen or so uh, children who are born every year here in Hawaii with a cleft palate, but um, it affects their lives immeasurably. Distinguished alum Takayama has this advice for the class of 2022. My advice is always keep your eyes open for opportunities. You know, I've had, I've counted them, maybe seven jobs in my, in my lifetime um, career and you know each job has led to another even if you're working at a job that you're not you know, hundred percent happy at do the best you can keep your eyes open never burn bridges there are opportunities before you um, all the time just do the best job you can as head of the higher education committee Takayama hopes to continue making a difference in his community for UHMTV I'm Lydia Tristan